Hello and welcome back to another video. This problem, we're looking at the function g of x is equal to negative 3 times x minus 1 squared plus 3. g of x is representing the height of a frog above the surface of the water, and x is the seconds after it jumps, seconds elapsed. We don't actually have to do anything with this equation because what we're looking for is the interpretation of the x-intercept of the function y equals g of x. So we're saying y is equal to g of x, and that's going to represent the height. x is the time that seconds elapsed since it jumped. So what is the x-intercept? Well, what is the x-intercept in general? The x-intercept is the value of x when y is equal to 0. In comparison, the y-intercept would be y when x is equal to 0. If you have a little function here, here, x-intercept, the values of x, say it would be 4 and maybe negative 1, when y is equal to 0, right at this x-axis right here. So what does x when, x when y equals 0 mean? Well, here, x, x is the seconds elapsed, or the time, when y is equal to 0, also known as g of x is equal to 0, so when the height is 0. Well, what is the height here? It's the height above the surface of the water. When the height above the surface is 0, that means it's at the surface. It's 0 inches above the water. It's at the water. So it's the time when the frog is at the surface of the water. This is our interpretation of the x-intercept of y equals g of x. This lines up with answer D. As always, thank you for liking and subscribing, and I'll see you in the next video.